The major concern this hour, though, is the fire burning in Sydney's north at South Taramara. Residents have been advised it is too late to leave. These are pictures, live pictures coming in. You can see the smoke coming up down lower. There are flames as well. The red is fire retardant that was dropped last hour. So close to homes it actually landed on some of them. Properties and lives are at risk, according to the latest update from authorities. We'll keep you updated on that fire in Sydney. We do have our reporters standing by in key locations as those 15 emergency warnings prompt real concerns in the coming hours. Let's begin with Samantha Chiari at Rural Fire Service Headquarters. And uh, Sam, a lot of concern in particular about the blaze just there in South Karamara. What's the latest you're getting there at headquarters? Tom, authorities here turned a different shade of white about 20 minutes ago when we saw that emergency warning issued for a bushfire burning out of control in South Taramara. Now, this is in Sydney's upper north shore. Uh, we've seen bushfires burning dangerously close to properties and homes and images coming into us here. Now, in terms of what authorities are advising residents in the region to do, if you are near Cannon R Road, you need to, of course, uh, protect yourself. It is too late to leave. Leave. Seek shelter as the fire approaches and please protect yourself from the heat of the fire. Now, authorities are saying it is too late for them to enter some regions near Cannon, Route, uh, Cannon Road sorry, at South Taramara where this fire is burning dangerously close to homes and also properties. Now, it is spreading quickly. What we're most concerned about now, Tom, is that southerly buster that is forecast to hit the Sydney region uh, in the next couple of hours. So so that will change the wind direction of this bushfire in particular that is already burning at an emergency warning level. And with a change in wind direction means more properties, homes, businesses and lives will be at threat. So right now the New South Wales Rural Service uh, Fire Services headquarters authorities are saying it is too late to leave for this particular bushfire that is burning at South Taramara in Sydney's upper north shore. The fire is spreading quickly. Properties are under threat. Now just to wrap up what else is happening in terms of the warnings here at the RFS. 15 emergency warnings are in place, eight watch and acts. Most of the fires so far this afternoon have been burning in the north of the state. This is the first fire we've really seen pick up around the Sydney region and those ferocious winds are really starting to pick up as well ahead of that buster that is predicted to hit around 7 to 8 p.m. this evening. So we've just started to see the winds increase around eastern parts of New South Wales. They're now gusting to over 60 kilometres per hour in some locations. This is ahead of the cool change as well. So the worst is yet to come. This afternoon and evening is looking very dangerous uh, around the Sydney region where, of course, we do have that catastrophic fire danger. Just to wrap up, Tom, 15 emergency warnings in place, eight watch and acts, most in the north of the state. But this fire in South Haramara in Sydney's upper north shore is what authorities here are most concerned about. Indeed. Thank you, Sam. You could see in the past few moments the impact the wind was having on those flames, the gusting of that wind every time it was hitting the, the fire front that we had a, a few moments ago, the live pictures here coming in still, the overheads of South Taramara in Sydney and the impact that was having. There has been that fire retardant drop, so that should have some impact on whether or not that spreads. And you can see on the ground as well, fire crews in readiness. There was one uh, property nestled right into that bushland so that would be the greatest concern right now but a lot of properties just nearby and you can see this is an area where there are plenty of homes but also plenty of trees this is the outer suburbs if you like of Sydney so uh, there are still plenty of there's plenty of foliage around there and that'll be the concern uh, on any prospect of this spreading you can see some fire crews a couple of uh, people there running around in the yellow uniforms that any embers do land somewhere else the minute they land on a fence in these properties that can quickly spread and you can see houses take um, well, the houses become engulfed really quickly so look we'll continue to keep you updated on that situation